very happy new year. This song is certainly part of the fabric of my life and my childhood. I always thought it stemmed back to the White Heather Club um, from TV and radio in the 1950s and beyond. It was certainly the case that in my granny's Hogmanay house in Ochtermachte, uh, this resounded and does so every year across the globe as family members wish in another a Happy New Year. In fact, the song is quite old. Uh, it stems back to 1865, um, and it was penned by P. Livingstone for the words and A. Hume for the tune. It was published as a broadside, in other words, a, a large piece of paper, as a sheet piece of sheet music from a company called The Poet's Box. Poets Box sprung up all over Scotland in Dundee, Edinburgh, Paisley and Belfast, as well as Glasgow, um, where this one was published. It's not known that these publishers had particularly anything to do one with one another, but they certainly would sort of meet each other's needs for love songs, sea shanties and songs such as this one that were incredibly popular. The music itself wasn't printed, it just tended to be the lyrics and most of the lyrics were for tunes that were well known. It's interesting that this was published nearly 70 years after Burns's epic Of Lang Syne, and it shares the same sentiments, although possibly with slightly more of a romantic uh, lean towards its music. Anyway, that's the story of a good new year. I hope the story of your good new year is indeed a good one. <laughs> 